Hello everyone and welcome to the next part of challenge series for Hitman to Colombia. In this part I will show you how to get it looks just like her assassin achievement. Now we will start with our default loadout however you can choose not to bring the gun since uh, we will be first anyway and uh, you have to lose the gun before that. Now for this achievement we are going to get 47 disguise of a tattoo artist and uh, he's hanging at the local bar. Maybe some of you have already noticed him. Also, we will be needing red poison, which we'll pick up on the way to bar. Actually, you can get the poison uh, just behind the washroom of bars. Pick that up and get inside to the bar. You can use the main door or just get through the window. Doesn't really matter. Now, we have to wait till everybody's turned away from the bar, just like right now. And uh, we're going to poison this beer on the counter. And don't worry, only our artist is drinking at the moment, so it's uh, always the right beer. You can guess uh, what will happen in a few seconds. He will get sick and will knock him out in the washroom and get his disguise and dump his body. I'm not sure if you can just leave the body in the washroom. Maybe you can, maybe you can't, but uh, we won't take the chance. I think this drug lord is going to kill me. If I mess up, he's going to kill me. You have to help me here. Call me ASAP. That is P Power. Real name Paul Powers. Celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV star. Seems this guy is really pissed on me for picking his tip. By the way, I'm about to puke out of my way. Is he gonna leave me alone or just gonna hang around me? I guess this guy is not going to leave me alone unless I return his tips. So I'll go and get him something else to do rather than annoying me. So I'm just gonna go and flip this fuse. That will make him come outside and do something else. And we're gonna go and run to the toilet and uh, take out the powers. So we got the costume. We're gonna dump his body outside this window, and uh, there is a box there. So we'll hide him in the box. So now it's time for us to go and Mr. Delgado. And uh, like I said before, if you brought a gun with you, make sure to lose it before approaching the door. You can drop it basically anywhere when nobody's looking at you. There's a broken house or some structure here nearby, so I'm just gonna drop my gun over here because I don't think uh, anybody comes over here. So in case uh, if you're continuing after this mission, you can always come and uh, take your gun back. I buy you down first. That's not open for this caution. You're entering the lion's den, 47. Tread carefully. Practically like everyone here is dangerous, senor. not like least Rico Delgado himself. Everybody loves that shit. Okay, All right, you're Mr. good Bowen. to go. Bongale, Follow bongale. me to the house. Mrs. Delgado wanted to meet you. She's a big fan. So now once frisking is done, we don't really need to hang out with this guard. You can just run straight to the manor and uh, meet Rico in his office. And uh, from there on, just talk to him and uh, all events will play by itself. Make sure to not kill Rico while there is still one of his bodyguard in the room. Because uh, in a bit, Rico will ask him to go out and uh, you and Rico will be alone in the room. And that will be your chance to get this achievement done. So just run ahead uh, to the stairs on your right and uh, then on the left uh, is the office of Rico Delgado. He's already there waiting for you. Excuse me, Mr. Delgado. Mr. Power, it's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, you landed a few days ago, so why, uh, why did it take so long for you to get here? 
Hey, you know what? <laughs> Never mind. Let's just get this over with. I have places to be and people to kill, you know how it goes, right? I certainly do, Mr. Delgado. You know, you look different on TV. I can't quite tell what it is, but there's something off. You know what they say. The camera adds 10 pounds. Yeah. Apparently, it also gives you new cheekbones. I just had surgery. Sure, sure. Well, I figured it was something like that. God, she's been under the knife yearly for the last decade. Me, personally, I would be caught dead doing something like that. Time will tell, Mr. Delgado. Okay, I'm ready. Let's get this thing fixed. Whoa, hey, Rico, don't worry. I've got this under control. Hey, the two guy. I'm watching. One wrong move, you know, I start feeling. You hear me? Calm down, all right? Everything's okay here. Just doing what's necessary. Rico, hey, I need you to stand down. Stop waving that thing around. No way, I'm letting my guard down around a stranger, Rico. Relax, Jose. We're fine. Better safe than sorry, boss. You're taking it too far, Jose. No guns. I'm sorry, but I'm just doing my job, patron. You need to keep still, Mr. Delgado. I wouldn't want to stab you by accident. Hey, Jose, I need you to leave us alone now. You're too wound up right now. You understand? All right, boss, all right. But I'll be back in a little while if I don't hear from you way one. Oh, finally. So peace and quiet. Can I finish my work now? <laughs> do what you do best, man. You got it. Rico Delgado has been eliminated. Nicely done. And this is how we get the achievement. Now, you can drag his body and hide in the boss room in case you're progressing this mission for further kills and uh, also make sure to pick up the car keys from him if you plan to get the achievement where you have to exit in one of his uh, sports car so once again thanks for watching the video guys and uh, please make sure to hit that uh, like and subscribe button and uh, see ya